you see the little streaks of gray, that's rain. Very green still. Fall's kind of starting. The leaves are starting to fall, but still looks pretty. This is Arkansas Tech. So the freeway is right there. And you come right down to Arkansas Tech. That's a big dome. Then Highway 7 curves around Arkansas Tech instead of straight through it. And then you have the baseball and softball fields. Looks like there's a little bit of baseball going on. Yeah, maybe not. Maybe it's just a little bit of practice or something. But I don't see anybody on the field at all. College apartments. And then downtown is right there. I gotta go up, I'm losing signal. Uh, yeah. Where is it? It's over Arkansas Tech. Oh my god. I didn't go that far. Hey, look. Good lord, how far does it go? Oh, you can go about two miles, but you got to be like 2,000 feet in the air. And then, um, well, you have enough battery to go there and back. But I've done it with the car where I was in the passenger seat and Ashley was driving, and then we went like oh, cool. six and a half miles and just followed me. <laughs> but I'm making a, I have so a YouTube. So is it one of those that just walks behind you? Like if you walk it? No, home, no, you have to, oh. you have to control it. But I have a YouTube video, so I'm making a video about doing oh, okay. all this as well. So I've, I actually got it pretty framed up pretty well. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, I enjoy it. That was my neighbor. This over here, that's the pool, public pool. And softball field tennis court, I believe. And the ag stuff. This is Arkansas Tech right here. Straight down view of it. Let's see if I can 
back away here. I don't know Arkansas Tech very well at all. Ooh, and I'm losing, I'm losing signal. That's downtown, so it's not terribly far from downtown at all. I don't dare say walking distance, but it's not far. And then these are all older houses. And we'll start flying back. Cow pasture, more softball, baseball practice fields, I'm assuming. what the name of these big apartments are right here. One of them caught on fire. I thought it got struck by lightning or something. But I'm headed back towards Walmart. Interstates to the left, left edge of the screen. Rows and rows of houses, though. white building in the center of the screen is Walmart. Big tall square building in the right is that cold storage place. Ashley's car. So that red box right there. That's the jail. You just can't go over the top of it. It's just right there. But you just can't go over the top of it. Other than that, it's not a big deal. They just don't want people with a drone, like, dropping stuff on there. like her car. I 
That sure looks like her car. Yep, that's her car right there. This is Walmart. About to run out of battery, so I'm gonna have to start flying home in just a second. It's a bigger building than you think. There's the new seven brew. There's seven brew right there. Backside of Walmart. Sumo restaurant. Starbucks is right there. It's a new Mexican food restaurant right there. Kubota dealership. Time to go home. Alright, got a new battery in it. to downtown. It's Mount Nebo. Magazine Mountain, I believe. Top center. I gotta go up higher. This is downtown right here. That's the train depot. That's the bar, huh? You know about the mailboxes over there? Mm. That's why I brought all of them open. Oh, that's been like that since we moved here. It's full of kids. <laughs> well, I thought those mailboxes aren't even getting used anymore. They're all up here now. I don't know. She said that her friend's mail still gets delivered down there. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, when I, we first moved in here, all the mailboxes were probably open, too. Really? Yeah, and we've been here a year and three months. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you kind of got me. But they've been like that. I mean, it happened. Yeah. <laughs> This is downtown right here. It's pretty small downtown to say the least. The brown roof, tan sides with the big parking lot behind it, it's the courthouse. I don't know the downtown very well at all. Don't go over there all that often. There's not a lot of point to go over there. There's three places you could go have a beer here in town and right where the right there in the center of the screen is where one of them's at. It's 
So when you fly a drone, this is called orbiting. You're picking one spot and keeping it in the center screen, and I'm going stick hard to the right, and then pan to the left. You can spin around something. So I'm pointing the controller that way. I could kind of like, I'm sitting on the tailgate here, I can kind of turn and face that way. If you look at this line right here, that's where, that's how you pointing the drone. So if I point over here, I'm pointing away from the drone. Point over here, I'm pointing towards the drone. Let's come down. So left stick down is down, left stick up is up. So up, down, and this is move left, move right, move forward, move back. And then this is um, in the vertical sp space down, and this is vertical up. Man, I had pho earlier. It's delicious. Quite full. Quiznos and Planet Fitness in this parking lot right here. So if you turn, downtown's on the left, train depots right in the center screen, Quiznos and Planet Fitness, the card store is there. And if I just pan up, the lake's right there. The dam is behind these hills, so the dam is right there and you can see that little bit of water and then no water that's the dam and there's a little narrow channel that goes all along right here and then that's where the lake right there is where the lake opens up and then the nuclear plant is right there but if you look this is downtown that's the lake it takes 45 minutes to get there. Over here is the strip pits where the old coal mine used to be. And the water kind of goes all the way back into here. And this is the bridge where Parkway crosses over it and the railroad bridges that you can go out to like um, London and the nuke plant. And then nuke plant's there. This isn't an island, but it's practically an island. And then the main body of the lake's right there. So all the good fishing is below the dam, but extremely close to downtown. So if you live anywhere in Russellville, you're pretty close to the lake. Because most people who live in Russellville live in like this area here, a little bit newer, nicer houses are at, all the way down to here. So you're never, you're never that far away from the lake at all. We're gonna start backing up and headed back to where I'm at, but we'll stay pointed at the lake here. I don't have a lot of battery left on the GoPro. I don't know if you can see the reflection. Arkansas Tech right where those lights are at. So far right of the screen is where Arkansas Tech is. up. 
house, flip around and face towards Walmart, which is right there. So we're going right stick hard to the right. So I'm shifting to the right without panning. And then I can use my left stick to the left to pan. So this is Main Street right here. Power Company, Western Sizzlins right there. The big white building that's in the top left corner here is going to be a manufacturing facility for like uh, trinkets and stuff, uh, CNC routers for like wood. And they're going to be doing a bunch of that sort of stuff. I think he said it was like Christmas style stuff. And my favorite steakhouse is right there. Man, I forgot the name of it right off the top of my head. I'm losing signal. I better go up. That's Walmart there. Well, I gotta call it good here. I'm about to lose battery. All right. Swapped batteries out. Last battery, only got three of them. We're screaming back over to Walmart. Let's see how Ashley's coming along. It sure looks like her car's still there. We're gonna hover over Walmart for a few minutes. Turn it into a bit of a time lapse. looking around, I'm looking at my neighbors, see where the noise is coming from. a little bit better view. Man, 
man, I tell you, it's really weird not having my beard. Well, I'm gonna do this for a few more minutes. Take a hyperlapse at Walmart. Bring it back on home. Ashley be back from Walmart with uh, stuff for next week and food and whatnot. But man, my beard is weird. Shaved my head too. I think that looks pretty good. But we'll uh, finish doing this and then call it a night. So we'll see. Well, then we're going to try and get up at three in the morning. It ain't going to happen. But we're going to try and get up three in the morning and go down to the river. I got the jogging stroller set up. I got a cooler. I have a little bit of beer left over. Uh, she's got to get worms and stuff. And then we'll uh, try and go fishing early. But I don't know. We'll see how that goes. So do this. Call a night. See you guys tomorrow.